<laughs> so who you got at seven? Uh, I got Kirk Cousins, the guy and who had his talk about best. carrying <laughs> offenses. Come on, Yo, dog. I do want to talk about carrying offenses. Let's put it this way. All right, football outsiders. It's like the analytics guys. They use a stat called adjusted games lost. What does that stand for? It's like no. it's like the players that got injured, but also accounting their like importance. So Aaron Rodgers getting injured is yeah. going to count more towards this stat than Terrence West getting injured for the Ravens or whatever. Right. Right. So Terrence it takes West. that into account. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Washington was first in the league last year and had the worst injury rate since 2002 of any team in the NFL in that stat. They were ravaged. Uh, Yet, guess what happened? Kirk Cousins got sacked 41 times because that that was a complete mess of offensive line. Oh, yeah. He still threw for over 4,000 yards. He was still eighth in touchdowns, and that's without his best weapons. And now he's going to a team that's going to protect him, and that's going to put weapons all around him. I think that Kirk Cousins is one of the more underrated quarterbacks in the league. I think that he is going to flourish this year. And talking about putting the, the team on your back, though, he put the team on his back, though, the whole year and the year before. He's had no running game. He's had none. Like, since... Fucking Rob, like not not even Fat who was the guy before Rob Kelly that signed Matt with the Jones? Matt Jones, right? Since Matt Jones, really, his only real running game is Chris Thompson, and that's because his swing pants out of the backfield. So put him in a situation where he has some guys around him. I think is going to be great. I mean, that was that was a really good case. Thanks, man. That was a very good case. Yeah. <laughs> One of your better cases. Did this in my own life. Hey. Did this in my own life.